guys, welcome back to my channel. I am going to do a long awaited taste test and comparison between the Dollar Tree brownie cookie bar mix and the Aldi cookie brownie mix. And basically these are brookies. If you're not familiar, a brookie is a brownie and chocolate chip combined and baked in a bar. So the one from the Dollar Tree was of course a dollar and it is 14 ounces. And the one from Aldi, I can't remember how much it was. It was definitely more than a dollar, um, but it is 19 and a half ounces. Both of the mixes call for the same ingredients, which um, are butter and egg and water. So they both call for the same thing. They both um, should be baked in an eight inch square pan. So I am going to um, start this baking process and I will show you along the way um, the differences in the cookie dough in the batter and my husband and I are going to do a taste test at the very end, so stay tuned. Hey, I wanted to take a quick break and show you um, what the mixes look like in the bowl. So this is the Aldi brownie mix, and this is the Aldi chocolate chip mix. This is the Aldi <laughs> chocolate chip mix and you really can't see any chocolate chips in there at all. I'm sorry, did I say Dollar Tree? I meant to say Dollar Tree if I didn't. So this is a Dollar Tree um, chocolate chip mix and this is the Dollar Tree brownie mix. Alrighty. Okay, so I wanted to show you the, um, the cookie dough and the brownie batter in the pan. So this is the Aldi pan right here. One thing I did forget to mention is that both recipes do call for an eight inch square pan um, that is greased. So I use the Pam baking spray, which has a little bit of flour in it. So this is the Aldi pan. And what I didn't realize is that there is a um, big difference in the sizes. So the Aldi brand, box is 19 and a half ounces, which is a little over one pound. And the Dollar Tree box, and this is the pan right here, is 14 ounces, okay? As you can see, um, you might not be able to tell, but the Dollar Tree brownie batter, they just, they give you just very, a very little bit of the batter. So it's mostly the cookie dough. And before with the dry mix, I could not see the chocolate chips. But there they are, and they are the mini chocolate chips, so they're very tiny. So the Aldi brand Brookie mix, they require, or they, re, they suggest that you bake it for 30 to 35 minutes. The Aldi brand Brookie mix, they recommend that you bake it for 45 minutes. So I'm going to stick them both in the oven and pull out the Dollar Tree brand early and leave the um, Aldi brand in the oven and then I'll pull them out and my husband and I will do a taste test and we'll give you our feedback. So I just pulled the brownies out of the oven. This is the Dollar Tree mix. And it um, said I was supposed to bake it for 30 minutes but at 30 minutes to me it was a little bit doughy. Um, so I decided to leave it in for another 15 minutes. I probably could have pulled it out earlier, but if you like a wetter, doughier um, brownie, then of course you're gonna bake it a lot um, for a lot less time. So this is a Dollar Tree one, and this is the Aldi one. To me, the Aldi one looks a lot better. This one, the instructions called for 45 minutes, and I did bake it for 45 minutes. So I'm going to let both of them cool completely, and then I will be back with a taste test. Okay, I am back with the finished product. So on this side is the Aldi brand and the other side is the Dollar Tree brand and my husband and I tasted both. And so now I'm going to give you my honest feedback. So with the Dollar Tree brand, um, as you can see here, there is definitely a lot more cookie than there is brownie much less of a chocolatey flavor. And this brownie is really chewy. So if you want a less sweet, less chocolatey brookie, then the Dollar Tree is the way to go. Um, Aldi brand, definitely more brownie than chocolate chip. So if you want more of a chocolatey flavor, 
then the Aldi brand is the way to go. Um, it is much softer than the Dollar Tree brand. Um, so if you want a softer, moister um, brookie, then this is the way to go. So my husband is not a big chocolate person, so he preferred the Dollar Tree brand over the um, Aldi, and I actually prefer the Aldi. So it's really just based on your own personal preference. The Dollar Tree Brookie, I mean, the, yeah, the Dollar Tree Brookie, like I said, is a buck. Aldi is a little bit uh, more than that. I wanna say it's $1.69.99, something like that. But anyway, that is our honest opinion and feedback. See you guys next time.